Hi friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are discussing the one more concept, diesel generator. In this diesel generator, uh, five types of uh, syst five systems is available. Uh, one is the fuel system, second one is the uh, lube oil system, third one is the water system, fourth one is the air circulation system, fifth one is the power system. These five systems uh, flow is these five systems flow one by one we are discussing today we are going to the fuel system fuel system in diesel generator uh, how the fuel is passing how the diesel is consumed after excess diesel how it will come in now we are discussing in this diesel generator area near one day tank is available in that day tank diesel was storing up to 1 kl up to 1 kl diesel was storing in that day tank this day tank little bit height is there when compared to diesel generator why because the diesel is coming day tank to up to pt pump based on gravity the diesel is flowing that's purpose the day tank it should be height when compared to the diesel generator this day tank diesel is coming from intermediate tank this intermediate tank also little bit height when compared to day tank why because the diesel is coming from day tank to uh, intermediate tank to day tank through gravity is coming any uh, industrial or IT buildings some underground tank also is there diesel storage purpose one underground tank is there in that tank diesel was storing after that storing diesel with the help of pumps with the help of pumps the diesel is pumping to intermediate tank with the help of pumps the diesel is transmitting to intermediate now the diesel is available in day tank now the diesel is available in day tank after that the diesel is passing through the water separator the diesel is passing through the water separator the main function of water separator diesel is the lightweight water is the more weight the diesel is available in top side the water is going to down that time inside one knob is there you will open that knob you will open that knob water is going out after you will tighten that knob water is separated with help of water separator next the diesel is entered into the filters fuel filters is available fuel filters is available this filters any unwanted particles it was filtering the output the diesel is entering to the PT pump up to day tank to PT pump the fuel flow is low pressure the fuel flow is low, play, low pressure why because it's coming only based on gravity after that the diesel enter into the PT pump PT pump is nothing but pressure timing pump this PT pump this PT pump internally is connected with a uh, camshaft of the engine camshaft and the flywheel camshaft and the flywheel through gear the PT pump was connected DC is running the PT pump is running this PT pump there is no uh, external power supply <coughs> this PT pump is, is a gear pump it's uh, depending on camshaft it's depending on engine shaft the PT pump is running the, uh, the diesel enter into the PT pump the PT pump what is doing the PT pump the diesel is pumping from input to output of common rail and injectors common rail after that it will goes to the all injectors here PT pump it was pressure is it will be increasing the uh, diesel pressure it will be increasing the diesel is sending to the common rail after that common rail to the diesel enter into the all injectors in this DC have left side is the 8 cylinders is available right side is the 8 cylinders is available in that left side 8 cylinders 8 injectors is available right side 8 cylinders 8 injectors is available these lines are the cylinders in that cylinder have the injectors right side is the 8 left side is the 8 to 8 into 2 16 cylinders 16 injectors is available that diesel is entered into the 16 injectors 16 injectors based on load how much load is there that corresponding diesel is spraying remaining excess diesel 
remaining excess diesel again it come coming to the data the excess diesel all injectors ex, all injectors and as well as common rail the excess diesel is again it's coming to the data again it's coming to the data so i take the separately one cylinder and one injector i am explaining this is the four stroke engine the diesel generator we are using in a four stroke engine in this four stroke engine this is the cylinder this is the only one line is nothing but one cylinder one injector one piston one piston this is the piston head this is the piston rod this is the cam shaft this is connected in a cam shaft this is the intake valve this is the exhaust valve this is the intake valve this is the exhaust valve four stroke is nothing intake compress generate the power and exhaust first intake means intake means air is taking that time this piston is coming to down after the piston is coming to up it was compressing the air it was the air is compressing that time the diesel is straining the power was the power was generated the power was generated again the piston going to down power was generated the piston going to down after the piston again going to up the unwanted things unwanted air it will go to the exhaust valve through exhaust the exhaust air is going four stroke is nothing but intake taking the taking the air after it will be compress after it will be compress after diesel spraying power was generated power was generated after generating power unwanted thing it will goes exhaust unwanted things it will goes to exhaust this is nothing but a four stroke engine the four stroke engine we are using in a diesel generator the diesel generator the injectors different based on your applications if it is the car engine we are using a crdi common rail direct injectors we are using in cars if you go for the cummins cummins diesel engines uh, cummins diesel engines we are using the stc stc is nothing but step timing controller means step timing controller in this stc uh, near to injector here diesel is coming how much is required that much is spraying excess diesel again it will go to the day tank that the diesel starting time blue oil also is coming in stc injectors stc injectors the blue oil also is coming and uh, uh, exit coming and going when the diesel is starting time the diesel is starting time blue oil also is coming this is the stc injectors we are using cummins remaining other generators we are using a mvc mechanical variable controller injectors remaining all generators this kind of mechanism mvc uh, injectors this yeah. governing system uh, engine controlling purpose we are using yeah. a fuel fuel controlling means indirectly the speed is, the engine speed it will, it will be controlling that purpose the governing system we are the purpose the governing system we are using here yes, shut up call the diesel uh, Yes, setup call mainly when diesel was stopping. That time diesel not coming to down. That purpose when diesel stop, the wall also is, it will be closed. The diesel is not coming to down. Uh, diesel compulsory it will filling on that pipeline. Watching my videos, please subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you.